Hinda, welcome to another episode of Black Friday and today I'm chilling with Tawanda from Clubs 365. He's the CEO, he's the manager, it's a brand new app. Uh, tell us more about the app, Tawanda. Well, Magdil, let me ask you a question before we go there. Yeah. If you hear Trivago, what goes in your mind? Uh, hotels. Hotels. Yeah. Uber? Cars. Cars, yeah. right. Clubs 365 is almost uh, is built along those lines as well. But... We're targeting specifically nightclubs and pubs. Yes. Yes. It has got, it's got two parts. The website part and the app part. So let me start with the website part, which is uh, direct uh, for, for the club owners directly. Um, so what the club owners do, well, what club owners do, they go onto the, on, onto the website, just like what, what, what you do with uh, Uber. You go register your nightclub on uh, club365.com, www. 365club365.com When you register there, you put a short description of your nightclub and then also you put your social media links on there. And then every time when you have an upcoming event, you go onto the website and then you upload your event. When you upload event, an event, an alert now will come to the app. That's the second part of Club 365. We've got an app that uh, but when you download it, you search uh, according to the city that you want, because it picks up all the uh, because of the Google GP uh, uh, maps that we have uh, you know, integrated in. So the advantage that uh, I'm trying to put in for the club owners is for them uh, not to put posters anymore. How often do you miss posters and billboards along the way? Yeah, you know? no, it's only in traffic that I see posters. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> It happens. But remember, somebody has pumped in a lot of money, you know, for you to see that uh, advert or to see that poster on the, on the poles on the street. But remember now, almost everybody has got a smartphone. So I'm taking that poster away from the street, straight to the phone. Because I know most people right now, 90%, they spend most of their t- uh, time on the phone. So if an advert comes to the phone, there is no way they're going to ignore it. They will definitely open it. So, as a club owner, when you upload your event, an alert will come to the, to, to the app. And then, since I've got the app on my phone, I'll tap it and then I'll read what event that you're having. Thereby saving you money, as the club owner, of putting posters all over. Okay, that's the advantage of Club 365. The second part of Club 365, which is the app itself, is for the, club pe- for the people who like to have fun. You know, or people who are planning to have um, you know, a good time after a hard day of work, or perhaps when you're going to visit as another city. So if you have the app on your phone, it will, and then let's say you're planning to go to Miami, and you don't know anything there around Miami. So when you get to Miami, you just tap, or you just go onto the app, uh, select Miami, it will show you all the clubs in Miami on that particular area that you left selected because remember they've got sub regions you know uh, for an example um, if I want to go to Deben I don't know anything in Deben but I want to have fun after a hard day's work I don't want to ask the guys at the reception uh, where is it happening these days you know where <laughs> <laughs> I want to plan my day knowing that you know after this, I'm going to go here and I'm going to go there. It also gives me an option to select the nightclubs or the pubs that I will feel comfortable, you know, for, for an old guy like me, you know, so that I don't have to go to a pub that's probably going to be like uh, the, mar- the target market is probably going to be like the uh, youth, you know. So that's the advantage of having Club 365 for the website and also for the app itself as well. Now, let's talk about the cost implications. As a club owner, how much does it cost? And as a consumer, how much does it cost for me to register and download the app? All right. You as a consumer, you don't pay anything. Nothing. Zero. Zilch. All you do is just go to Google Play, uh, download it, and then just register with your, G- with your Gmail account. But there's a, on the first page of the app, there is a way it says uh, regis- sign up with your, G- with your Gmail. With, with your Gmail. Then that's it. You don't pay anything. For the club owner, it's a uh, hundred US dollars, which is about one thousand five hundred rand per year per club. So imagine how much you're gonna save 
thousand rand. I mean, eight thousand five hundred per year. That's a lot compared to how much you are going to put posters around the whole building to to show that uh, you're going to have an event. So those are the cost implication for the club owners. And um, how would you say it's different to perhaps you know me as a club owner going on Facebook and uploading my event on the events page on Facebook? How is it different from that? Well. If I'm not following you on Facebook, I'll definitely miss your events. Is that true? That's true, right? Hundred percent, right? But then with Club 365, you do not have to follow anyone. You see, that's the advantage of Club 365. It's an open platform for everyone. So, hence, when, when uh, they upload an event, the alert now will force you as a subscriber to to open that alert so that you can see what's happening. So you don't have to follow. Uh, anyone with a club 365 as compared to Facebook, so that's the advantage that uh, the club owners need to think about when you're registering. That you know what your target market is everyone who's got the app on their phones. They do not necessarily have to follow you. That's the advantage that it has. So now, if I don't own a club or a bar, um, but you know I'm a promoter. For example, let's say we're hosting a podcast and chill pool party. Uh, can we utilize your services, or is it only strictly for clubs and bars and restaurants? Well, currently, um, we still we still working on the part where we call a uh, one-time event, uh, OTE. That's another section that we're still uh, developing. But you know, all these things comes with uh, cost implications uh, for the developers and all them. I did this um, on my own with my from my own pocket, so. I'm looking at uh, after about a, a, a good one year, I'm gonna uh, integrate that one-time event, whereby your event will be broadcasted, uh, will, will be on the app for a good one month for a certain fee, you know. So whenever you have like every day when you need to remind people, you can just go in, we still on on this sub day, and then that alert will still pop up to remind people about your event. So that section of a one-time event is still coming up. So I'm doing baby steps right now. <laughs> Fantastic! No, we love it, man. And uh, if I'm a club owner, I'm listening right now. Um, you know, I want to advertise. I want to register on the app. Where can I find you guys? Well, go www.clubs365.com. There's very easy steps to follow, and then you just register your nightclub there. Put in your short description there. Uh, put in a picture there. And then uh, you pay your hundred dollars or equivalent. I think currently the current rate is about one thousand five hundred rand, which is quite minimum from what you're going to benefit too when when people see your events coming through. Look, uh, Magjib, for a club owner, you need to make money almost on a daily basis. Or if some of these uh, uh, pubs that we have like your news cafe if I may say they wish open 24 7 365 but you have your quiet days like your Mondays your Tuesdays but you've got your specials your happy hours so how are people going to know about your happy hours you know you're not going to put every week posters for your happy hours but that's going to cost you a lot of money but let's say you've got in a happy hour on a Tuesday because you know it's a quiet day you just log in onto the web onto the website, post about your happy hour or your special that you have, and I'm gonna get an alert. So straight from work, I'm gonna get that alert, and I'm gonna pass by your place because I saw there's a happy hour ten rand a beer for today. I'm gonna come there. I will end up spending more than the ten rand that you have advertised. So it's a win-win for both. You know, that's how as a club owner you have to think along those lines. And as a consumer, how can I get my hands on this app? Download it on the Google Play. Uh, we're still waiting for the iStore. You know, the Apple guys, they take their time to approve stuff. But currently, it's available on Google on uh, Google Play Store. Just download it, Club 365. Just look out for this label there, Clubs with a Z <laughs> or Z, as some people call it. Uh, just download it, register, and enjoy. You know, for those guys who are out of the country... If you want to travel to start to Africa, for an example, just when you have that Club 365 on your phone, it will now show you where you're going to have fun before you even get here. That's why our motto or our catchphrase is hashtag find out what's happening before you go there. You see? <laughs> Fantastic, Tawanda. Love the app. 
And uh, if you are my Jaiva now or you're a club hopper, uh, this is definitely the app you should get. Club 365. And yeah, Tawanda, thank you so much for coming through, man. Thanks very much, my dear man. Thanks Fantastic. I'll see you at the next club. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> this has been another episode of Black Friday. We are here. Boom. Podcast and chill. Matt G, the ghost lady, and Lynn Moleko.